This is a 1972 Volkswagen truck. It was uh, originated from a 1972 Volkswagen and is titled as a 72 Volkswagen. You're never going to have to worry about running out of gas in this old girl because it doesn't use any. This is 100% powered by electric motor. And uh, the build on this thing was done over the last 20 years and absolutely beautiful inside and out. The front bumper is great. Uh, it's got the correct wheels on it, uh, like new tires, and uh, runs and drives excellent. The top speed on this thing is about 60 mile an hour, and it does have a four-speed uh, Volkswagen manual transmission that shifts great. We just got it in. It has uh, beautiful dark red paint on it from bumper to bumper. It does have all steel fenders on it, custom box, obviously. But the fit and finish on it's just great. I mean, it's got a little scratch right here, very small. Uh, very few minor imperfections, but this car will be the uh, envy of a car show. If you take it to a car show, I mean, people just swarm around it. Just super cool. Inside here in the old gas door is where they have the uh, plug-in to plug into the uh, charging system. As we look at the roof, the bodywork and stuff on the top of the roof is excellent. Uh, just done by a, a complete artist on this truck. Does have some solar panels. Also underneath this, this all slides back, completely slides back and drops down a little bit and that's where all the rest of the batteries are. There's batteries in the uh, under the hood and there's uh, probably six or seven batteries, something like that under here. If we look up and down the sides, the body and paint is nice and straight. We open up the inside of the doors, it's painted just as nice as the outside, just done beautifully, all new gaskets, door panels, seats, carpet, everything is super professional on this truck. Headliner was done very nicely. It's got some speakers in the back, it does have seat belts. I can't say enough about everywhere you look on every corner of this truck is just done super professionally. You look at the inside of the door jams and stuff are all painted nicely. Carpet, trim, everything done nice. These pins just come up here. Both these pins come up and that whole back just slides. Whole top slides back to get at the batteries if you need to uh, ever change anything or do anything. But they, uh, you shouldn't even have to open that up because they uh, plug in from up front. If we look down the driver's side, super nice and straight. Steel fenders on it. Running boards are excellent. The mat's nice on that. Chrome trim's all nice. Like I said, there's just no disappointments. This is a super cool old truck. Definitely one of a kind. Here's the VIN, manufactured by Volkswagen, 72. That's how it's titled. Now the coolest part about this truck even though the paint and interior is neat, the coolest part about this truck is driving it. So there is no clutch in it. You just turn the key. Um, also, all the lights and stuff function and work. Wipers work on it. A little slow right now since it's dry, but they work. Um, Pioneer CD player works excellent. It's like I said, manual four speed. Put it in first, take right off. When you uh, shift without the clutch, you just let go of the gas just a little bit. Nice easy shift. As far as range and stuff on the battery, I need to check, but the uh, previous owner thought about 40 miles, so it's not something you want to jump in and go a long ways, but uh, 40, 40 miles on a charge. Um, 
makes pretty cheap transportation. Speedometer works on it. The uh, Volkswagen body's got 83,931 miles. Not that that matters, but shocks are excellent. Like I said, the coolest thing about this car is just how neat it drives. I mean, it drives down the road awesome. Front suspension's good, alignment's good. Pretty cool oddity car, I'll tell you that. There's a lot of room inside of it too, with the steering wheel and the, everything just the way it is, there's a lot of room for two grown-ups inside. Goes nice and straight down the road, the uh, brakes work excellent as well. Absolutely no pull, left to right on the brakes. Got a nice full pedal. Second gear right now, doing about 30, 35 mile an hour. Third gear. Like I said it takes a little while to get it up to speed, but uh, once you do, this thing just cruises down the road great. Just right into fourth. Very comfortable, as I mentioned before, the shocks are good, front end's good, brakes are good. It's a really an awesome car to drive. It's about 55 right now. Handles the bumps, excellent. Turn signals all work, lights all work. We've got our amp gauges and our bolt gauges, stuff like that. As far as our brakes at a high uh, highway speeds, no pull. Really cool truck.